Okay, the setup is done, so here comes Lara Croft. Apparently not. Oh. Okay, yeah. yeah, quick note about this run is that uh, it's going to be co-op and New Game Plus, and New Game Plus in this game doesn't... Well, it actually, yeah, it does break absolutely everything. Yeah. Because we get a bunch of weapons and uh, health, which allow us to do a whole lot of skips that would not be possible in New Game. And I'm Cody, I will be playing as Todek, which is the blue guy. And I'm Ariwa, I will be playing as Lara, who is the red guy. Guy, totally. <laughs> yeah, guy. <laughs> something but yeah let's start so three two one go and <laughs> thank you and already on the first level it begins with two uh two glitches first lara is going to backflip into a wall and suicide and hopefully. and Todek is going to uh hopefully get over this wall right here without opening the opening a door that's supposed to open and there goes lara yep oh you made it Yep, we are true. That's We're supposed nice. to open open a door right there, but it's too slow. Uh, what people saw just now wasn't the truth, because this game has a lot of lag and you don't always see what's happening. Yeah, we are, <laughs> despite being uh, right next to each other, we are playing on two computers online. Yep. It just allows us to do a couple of skips later. Yeah, there's one fairly major skip that cannot be done offline. And right now we are killing ourselves using uh, bombs. Please don't Okay, that was some interesting lag right there. That said, lag can do wonderful things in this game. Yes. Yeah. Right now, Lara is completely dead. So I'm not completely dead. Well, pretty much. No, I'm completely dead. And what is going to happen is that Lara is going to respawn through a wall right here and go straight to the next area. Yeah. That skips a uh, cutscene, so it's really useful. And now we're gonna. Skip entering this room completely just by conveniently jumping uh, out of bounds. And now I'm gonna have to kill myself using a bunch of enemies. Let's see. Please hit me. Yeah. This uh, skips something like three rooms, so it's really there we go. That's nice. Real nice death. Yeah. And we are not supposed to be in this area at all. Yeah. And there we go. The door is still closed, but it doesn't matter. <laughs> There's nothing really blocking our way. Also, if anyone wants to count how many times we die during this run, feel free to try. It's Gr a lot. Yeah. Some, yeah. Good, good luck with the counting. Because <laughs> 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 we will be suiciding a lot in this game. Because uh, yes. only, only one player has to enter rooms and hit triggers. I so did that really weird uh, rotating rolling, because sometimes the camera hates us. And it won't let us pass through the door. Yeah, the camera locks us to be in uh, the same area all the time, so we kind of have to fiddle around it. Like, we will be splitting up as much as we can, but the camera is restricting. Yeah, although you can break the camera so that it no longer restricts yeah, but anything. It, it, yeah, if you break the camera, we won't be seeing anything at all. Yeah, then it just stays on put and you can do whatever you want, but you can't see anything. Yeah, luckily, those are old strats and won't be necessary anymore. Yeah. And one more death. I just triggered this cutscene here and uh, the sequence and suicide because I'm not gonna be needed here at all. It's a really good co-op game but the downside is that if you're playing as Toad like you will be doing this a lot. That's true. <laughs> and then I'm just gonna help Lara yeah. reach the exit and die <laughs> because we I might would have to use yeah. a rope as a bridge. As a bridge. <laughs> <laughs> Two fifth three. That's not bad. Yeah, that's not bad. That might be the longest level in the run. Pr yeah, not unlikely. necessarily. The Actually, last, really the last level can There's take a lot of time. The last level and Toxic Swamp yeah. are fairly lengthy. 
And the this level would be fairly lengthy if it wasn't for a massive skip. Yes. Yeah. We're supposed to get like three objects that unlock a door. But doors are not well made in this game. So we're just gonna skip skip in, uh, the entire level. Yeah. First we're gonna see. Yes, oh, I made that pump jump. Please come back. Yep. And like I said, one, only one of us has to hit trigger, yeah. so I'm just gonna go hit this trigger. And there we go. So they had to come back there because uh, that spawn point is kind of broken. Yeah, it kills you if you try to spawn yeah, to it if Totex too yeah. far away. Now I'm just gonna suicide here, and Lara is going to backflip into the door. Not into the door. Well, to the side of the door. Yeah. And then I'm just gonna respawn on the other side. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we were supposed to show the time, but well, it's 30 seconds, so uh, r just about 30 seconds. Yeah, I think the record is like 27. Yeah, probably. really optimized. But with that strat, it's not going to happen in 30 seconds. Also, if you s ever see us throwing spears randomly, it's because for some stupid reason, if you throw a spear and then do a bomb jump like that, you get more distance. As long as the last weapon you have used is a spear, it works. And yeah. there is no explanation as to why. This is a massive vertical level that you have to jump. I completely messed up the jump. Yeah. Never mind. Never mind. Uh, you can see the goal down there. We will we'll be base jumping there. Hopefully. I jump really light, that might be bad. Yeah, uh, it should be fine. And we are both dead at the moment. And yeah, it's oh yeah, fine. No, got it's it first try. <laughs> what happened was that uh, I spawned into Lara's corpse, which was mid-air above the exit. And the game just said, oh, we were, you reached the exit, despite both players being dead for a moment. Yeah, uh, we also rope jumped there. Which is this technique that allows you to jump infinitely as long as you can uh, attach a rope to something. Which is oh, most, in most I cases. I have the wrong sphere. <laughs> nice. Yeah, in most cases, the thing that gets uh, grappled is me. Also, a shout out to Greenlink for discovering that trick. Yeah. Yeah. It <laughs> really breaks the game. And the console version usually has an advantage during boss fights because they have a little trick that allows you to rapid fire the most powerful weapons more easily. Yeah. And once again, Lara will be backflipping into a wall because opening this door would take a long time. We'd have to yeah. solve a bunch of puzzles. But you, there are those round things on the floor. You have to push those uh, <laughs> spheres into them, but we no. don't really go for that sort of thing. Instead, we clip through. Yeah. The way clipping works is that uh, when you're dead, you will be respawning to your co-op body. But if you mash, mash a key while you're respawning, for some reason, it, it can just put you on the wrong side of the wall. Yeah. Those uh, spike walls look really deadly, if you haven't noticed. I'll try one. Yep, that's <laughs> dead. Yeah. <laughs> Still counting? Yeah. I hope. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> so deadly. <Yeah>. So deadly. <laughs> <laughs> it's just <laughs> impossible to survive. I hope I can make it, make it actually. Yeah, you should. My, <laughs> my frame rate is a bit lower than it normally is. I'm running, well, at, running at like 20 FPS. Matter. I'm killing myself here because it'll make it easier for Koti to make the... Now landing now? 11. Fine for Kotex still. It's gonna go up. Trust yeah. Me. And right at the beginning of this little bit, just gonna do a bit of rope jumping, it, it's not a major skip, just uh, avoids one cutscene. Yeah, you can skip it uh, in another way, but it takes precision, and we don't have that. So... Yeah. Dying in the escape doesn't really cost anything. I only spawned there so I could kill myself. Nice. There was no re real reason, I just wanted to be there in case you uh, mess that's up skips a cutscene, so we do it because of that. This also skips a cutscene. Yeah, we're supposed to open a door If I can here. do it. Just try again. Yeah, we're supposed to open a door in this small room, but it's nice. just faster to go in and out to make the next area load. What that yeah. causes is it makes the door to be still closed, so... Not a big deal, though. Just click right through. I'll still have to wait here for Lara to die, so we can both continue. Yeah, actually kill myself, not die. Yeah. There's a difference. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna kill myself right there because otherwise uh, I'd have to slowly make my way up here. As Todek uh, climbing up is quite yeah, slow. Yeah, it, it 
it okay, relies on Lara's see. rope. I believe. And we don't want to do Is that. that yeah, yeah that's, that should be that good. should be good. And I'm gonna just kill myself again. Yep, there we go. Here that's we have to backtrack to load the next area. Yeah, that's that's if we just did this fairly big one. So oh we right, have to, yeah. we have to go backwards so that the next area loads. If we don't hit that load trigger, uh, the game will just freeze. And yeah, we'll, we'll be right here where the game freeze. Whoops! Oh, I lived. That's yeah. That's we're good. not supposed to go there. Those uh, so the dying to the drop is a bit random. In this area, we actually have to open the door. This is why you want to run New Game Plus because you get the uh, bigger grenade launcher. I don't remember the name. <laughs> yeah, heavy yeah, heavy grenade, grenade launcher. But if we don't open this door. Uh, the next area won't. Uh, next load trigger won't load. Yeah. And in the next area, we have to roll a ball into the <laughs> fiery bit pit, right? Yeah. Yep. The I'm ball is really random, so we don't use it. <laughs> <laughs> Most painful room for a single player IO? No. Yeah, <laughs> and it used to be the same for uh, two player. Yeah. It was one of the most difficult rooms in the game, like this ball right here. Never mind. Really that. annoying. You won't <laughs> be seeing it again. This is one of the more difficult clips in the game, in my opinion. I guess you have to do it. It's a fairly precise angle to go through. Yep, not quite. Second try, that's good. Yeah. Next, it's going to be a fairly difficult uh, cutscene skip. You can see Xotl at the end. If the final succeeds. boss. Yeah. It nice first try. Nice first try. There's the final boss. He's a bit stuck on the button. Yeah. And we still have to clip through an uh, invisible wall to reach the exit. 253, that's really nice actually. Yeah, that went really well. Considering that the practice run was 502. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. I'm gonna increase my lead on the death count right here. I believe Flooded Passage is like one of the least broken levels in the game. Mm, well, yeah. Just There's one level that's not broken at all, so it takes the lead, but otherwise... I mean, this level has a bunch of minor skips, but it doesn't have much major stuff. Like, right here we can do a uh, bomb jump, if we can get this. This was being trouble from a moment ago. There we go. I am looking at you. <laughs> yeah, I know. Also, in case you have noticed, the fastest way to move around is scrolling. Yeah. Which is just smashing one button. Always fun when a game has a movement deck like that. All are up, so oh, that's here's bad. a little glitch. Uh, they won't by the see lag. it. They won't see I'm, it. Because I'm at the moment a bit stuck. Come on now. Please, hit it. Yeah, I'm a bit stuck because uh, those three pillars over there, going up and down, were all up on my end, but not on Arivas. Yeah. So Please. I had to mess around it with a bit. Heavy grenade launcher is great for thing, things like this because it allows you to shoot thing, uh, okay. the splash damage. I'm just gonna those kill myself again. And hopefully that will. Yes, it did it. it. Yeah, it did. It, it makes me respawn on the other side of the gap. Well done. Because you don't always spawn to your partners. There are some set spawn locations. Yeah. Which are usually annoying, but in this case we can actually use them. These are always impossible to make, as you can see. <laughs> Sometimes that you was can some make interesting it. lag. I'm still doing the cutscene. Okay. <laughs> okay. Good. There we go. And we're supposed to break this wall with a ball, but whoops! I think oh. I got I fell inside the wall. I guess. What? Stop falling inside the wall, please. There we go. Nice. <laughs> yeah, this is the level that's the least broken. If you don't oh count yeah. the boss levels. Or the yeah, two boss levels. Uh, you just have to run away from a fish. Yeah. On land. There's not, not much you can do. It's, I believe if you stay alive at certain points. It's uh, slightly faster. Yeah. But even if you... Actually, I don't even believe in that now because... There was that one run where we both stayed alive com uh, the entire run. It and it still took a while to show up. So would you like to slow down for me? It's not like we're in a hurry here. 
I can't slow down. Yes, you can. I have to go fast. Actually, I'm, I'm afraid of the I'm pain. going to die because my frame rate is not dropping to 15. Just kill yourself. <laughs> Never. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's better. You got this. Probably. I'm still gonna respawn when you do the second bump jump because I don't trust yeah. you. It's a good idea. Hey, I made it. Good. It's kind of sad watching uh, the screen I'm playing on is running everything on low at 15 FPS, and right next to me is a screen that's everything set to max at 60 FPS. But I can't use it because there's a, a tiny bit of lag. <laughs> yeah, we got the fish. I'm just making myself. We can try to clip through this gate. It never works. Might be possible in theory, not in practice. I'm always gonna try, try it. Yeah. You know? <laughs> twisting bridge, best level in the game because you never get to see a bridge. Yeah, and nothing twist. Well, I suppose the route is a bit twisting, but. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the first thing we do is we go backwards. Yeah. Just navigating by our names. Yeah. Just a normal jump. And there you go, we are out of bounds. There was just nothing stopping us from doing that. Yeah. <laughs> 20 do that, I'm, I'm doing fine. Yeah. You're gonna die more than I did. <laughs> <laughs> if it makes you feel any better, I'll do my best. And once again, really difficult level for me. Yes, Kati has to really work for this. Yep. Here I just spawn in case you mess up the jump. Yeah. And then we can rope jump right to the exit, hopefully. Yeah. If this I can yeah. get This level rope. is pretty punishing because if you mess up the jump, it's possible that uh, Lara will drag Tozek. I will make it. <laughs> I will not <laughs> give up. <laughs> yeah. No. No, 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 no. I'll, I'll, I'll die, die, die. Yeah, I'll, <laughs> I'll just uh, save kill. Ooh. If I fall down from here, we have to start the level from the beginning, so we'd rather not do that. If things start to go yeah, poorly... Yeah, Okay, there we go. And I'm just gonna kill myself. Yeah. That skipped the cutscene where roll, uh, fireballs of death roll um, down. Well, basically, I think that skipped the level. Yeah. Oh yeah, the, I was talking about rope camping. <laughs> you have another way of getting to these stairs. But... Yep. There's, There's a, a bunch of ways to break every level in this game. Pretty much, yeah. I mean, some of the strats we use might be already be outdated. Yeah. We mostly did individual level runs like two years ago. This is a stage that's only online only, isn't it? Yeah. 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 Come right up. That's why we need the second computer. Nice. I'm really good with those jumps. <laughs> yeah, these jumps are way They're more difficult than they look. One more death for me. Nope. Oh. This is a one-time only trick, a spear warp. Lara's gonna draw a spear and Todek is gonna warp to it. Ooh. Nobody knows not, why yeah, it works. That is not useful in that one place and nowhere else. And it saves like two seconds maybe. Oh, barely. That's normal, I oh. guess. Oh. Where are you? I have no idea. Maybe walk? Yeah, you yeah, got yeah, it. Yeah, <laughs> I'm there. <laughs> so it's a that may not have been the scary. intended route. And here comes the part where yeah. we are online. You see, you cannot do the skip while yeah. offline. It requires uh, as some. You'll soon see, lava. lava is hot and it will kill you. Yep. Like this. And now, Lara will just get stuck me there, and on my end, she will fall down. There we go. I have I have now spawned uh, at the bottom of the level. Hopefully, I will die soon. Great. There we go. And lava is hot. Lava is hot and lethal. <laughs> That skips like how much? Half the level. There's an Maybe entire <laughs> section that we just skipped. Another boss level which is just showing Spears of Light. Yeah. Spear of Light is a weapon you get from the final stage. It's only really useful for bosses. But the boss levels are really boring anyway. Yeah. Especially in speedrun because you can't just clip out of bounds. Or rope jump to the exit. Actually 
actually fight something. Maybe you should switch to the Spear of Light. Maybe. Uh, I didn't quite die, it was close. I saved him. <laughs> Kill Stealer. <laughs> Twin this one, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Another gate level. Yeah. Uh, in this case, we are not gonna do the spawn clip because there's there a faster way. Yeah. It's a bit more unreliable, but I mean, we could have done that before, but why not showcase all the all the multiple ways this game is broken? Yeah. I'm yes. I'm completely unnecessary for this kid, so I'm just gonna kill myself. So I'm not gonna wait for him to die. Please don't die! <laughs> oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> Nice. Nice. The sad thing about this game is that if both players die, you get the uh, load screen. But if yeah. only one dies, uh, you just respawn no. immediately. No. Oh. We always like to try to kill this monster uh, during the cutscene. It's really difficult because you have to position the spear really well. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Those gates are reliable. Well, you can explain how to do that trick because I honestly have no clue. <laughs> uh, you press roll, jump and rope around the same time and then you just click through. That was an unimaginable just for me. This section is a bit difficult because the frame rate even normally is quite yeah. low for me and now it's even lower. I think that looks like 10. <laughs> That's nice. Also the uh, flames at the beginning are random. Yeah, and Com combine uh, that with lag, it's next to impossible to do as Todek or player 2. One second thing, not too bad. Yeah. Oh, yeah, and another level where Kati is really yep. useful. <laughs> I'm gonna uh, run with Lara for a while and then I'm gonna kill myself. Yeah. And that's it. <laughs> I might what? spawn at the end You'll just for spawn safety. At the end. I don't. You don't actually need me, but I'm just gonna be. Yeah, I, I need you because <laughs> otherwise the game thinks that we didn't complete the level. I don't know why. I mean, this is the route you have to take. Probably not. Yes, it is. So I'm just it's gonna kill myself right there. I think you can use this rock. Yeah, you can use that rock. The spear Lara is throwing is the Spear of Darkness, also a late game unlock. I and it's one of the most game breaking items. You get in the it game. from the same level as. Uh, is it? As like you the final get the level? Yeah, the final level. You have to kill Toad. Uh, Shuttle in. <laughs> you, 10 have minutes Toad, <laughs> yeah, yeah. you have to kill Toad. You have to kill Toad. That's easy. <laughs> well, it's really hard because I can only damage you with mines. It's also Lara's only platform option in a co op game as well. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, I'm just gonna. Yeah, be here for safety. This is so <coughs> Sub one, okay. Yeah, that's nice. Final map. Y yes, yeah. this is the final level. Yeah, of the our game. estimate is fairly generous. <laughs> yes. <laughs> 32 deaths. <laughs> 32 deaths. <laughs> 32 deaths in yeah. just over 22 minutes. So let's try to finish this in less than 10 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm gonna kill myself so I can spawn through this pillar right here. Yeah. Try to catch my body. Yeah. So final boss is just taunting us and about to start the first first phase phase yeah. of this fight. We are not going to care too much about yeah, it. Yeah. Uh, that looks really strange, but it's because of the lag. There we go. So we're just gonna walk right through this uh, a spiky thing. Yeah. Well, I didn't walk through it. I just yeah, uh, you died through it. Yeah. I just. Died. <laughs> <laughs> Please cut it. <laughs> Sorry. There's a fast kill for this boss, but we're really bad. <laughs> we're not getting it because I died. Well, yeah, that's that's the reason. So it's because Scotty is bad, not me. <laughs> you can always blame me. Yeah. That's good. Nice. nice, we got the quick kill. At least the second one. Yeah. yeah the second quick kill in that what fight is basically just a point blank railgun shot. Yeah. It sounds fairly simple, but you need to have uh, 
killed a bunch of enemies without taking damage before uh, the There's a thing uh, underneath <laughs> our ammo and health meters. It's the relic meter. When it's full, uh, your... We get some buffs. Yeah, you get some buffs dependent on an item you can get. In, on some in most cases, like a uh, double shot and power yeah. shot. Which but the then there's the item that gives all the buffs, which yeah. we have. And that's why the railgun just insta kills. Yeah. So Basically, I just did two. Uh yeah, thank you. <laughs> what, the what was that? What was that final kill? <laughs> <laughs> so he died. It's like he, he was already gone, but then he wasn't. I have a feeling we are a bit ahead of schedule after that. <laughs> yeah, we might be. <laughs> slightly. Uh, yeah, mind if we show some uh, ways you can break this game? <laughs> oh my, I have to. Yeah, I have, have to do stuff. Yeah. Hopefully, the chat will be kind. It won't take long. You didn't actually send the invite. Yeah, because oh, yeah. I have to. I don't know how that works. I never invite anyone. Yeah. So what what level? Uh, forgotten gates. Forgotten Let's gate. just go through the gate because. Oh yeah, we can go. Through you this might remember gate. these gate levels, <laughs> where we don't really care for the gate. We already showed you the way to spawn clip through it and uh, just walk through it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Those are by no means the only ways. Uh, what should we do? Uh, let's let's do the classical one. The really classical one. Yeah, okay, the so I'm the just gonna drag you. Yeah, the one. So we we're gonna break the, the camera. Wing. Yeah. We're, we're not going to break the camera. We're just going to use it to pull my uh, Lara's body through the gate. Hopefully. So we're gonna be far apart, and hopefully. Just go for it. Use uh. my screen. <laughs> just use my screen. There we go. That's one yeah. way to skip the gate. I believe we counted that we have like seven or eight different ways of going through <laughs> the yeah. gate hey. <laughs> without opening it. <laughs> There's also a trick with the balls that you can use, but we don't really do that. We don't touch. Oh, like them. placing the balls on the platform yeah, and opening and the gate. <laughs> that that's a really difficult trick. I we'll like uh, let's try the ball jump. Yeah, let's try it. This is a oh. fairly difficult trick. I oh, have. We have to practice this a bit. Okay, that looks good. Yeah. Did you get oh, it? Oh, not no. quite, not quite. We're supposed to use the uh, use the ball and bombs to get on top of the gate. Yeah, it's I really difficult. Yeah, I didn't time. quite make it. So we'll do it the other way. Yeah, if I, if we both make it, we can just go go through the gate from there. But we're just gonna use a uh, different setup to get up there, which is yes. again one of one of the different ways of going through it. Yes, you have so to use rope jumping for this, but Just jump up there. I'm not. Yeah. Gonna, I'm gonna kill myself. What was my final death count, by the way? Thir Thirty-four. Thirty-four. That's pretty good. Yeah. Thirty. You should cut it, by the way. Yeah. Yeah. And then we're just gonna jump right over the gate like yeah. this. And there we go. <laughs> then there's uh, the platform under the level. Yeah. You hit it, and then it triggers the next level. I mean. Like, let's go oh, through oh the gate right. by oh, yeah, yeah, hitting yeah, the platform under the level. This is... This is kind one of weird. Of one of the trickier ones. Yeah. I guess. It, it relies on a strange thing that you have to do. Yeah, Lara will just backflip into the wall again. Then I hit rope and hopefully I'm underneath the level. No, I wasn't. There's some small platform right under me, and Lara is supposed to hit it. Like when that. you see my name jumping up and down, uh, that means I hit it. And then you can just no, I was too low. rope jump to the exit. That's basically it. Yeah, that's basically it. Uh, yeah, let's try again. Yeah, try it once more. If you can actually we get it. it. Yep, that's good. No, nope. no. Nope. Now you are way too low. Just climb yeah, up. Yeah, no, I'll climb up. I think Just I need to be a yeah, bit higher. Higher. No, a bit not that high. <laughs> this should be good. Yeah. And there we go. The DLC characters can't even d perform a backflip, so it's only Lara Croft who can do that trick. Yeah. That's yep. why we use Lara Croft. Uh, we. W that's why we couldn't have donation incentives for the other DL uh, the character costumes. Oh, actually, don't go yet. Let's try this thing. Okay, let's try it. Todek doesn't have a backflip as mentioned, so 
this is the only place in the game where I can get stuck on a wall, and it can do funky things. <laughs> oh, I got it! I got, got it. it! Yeah, I got. I spawn in a really weird place here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's no real use for it, but it's funny. <laughs> And now oh. I'm stuck here because yeah. there's a set spawn location, and the enemies don't really know what to do, so they just yeah. walk off. Then and there's the desync thing. I think the desync is like the last one. There's the single player one, but I don't know how to draw the spears for that. Yeah, because I don't play single player. I can't, I don't know how to do that. So and it's really boring because you can just yeah. live through the Shout game. Shoutouts to Fatalist for being re being a god at the single player. <laughs> All right. And completely breaking this game with Davos. Uh, you should. Probably stay Actually, down yeah, there. Probably a good idea, actually. It's kind of important for the desync. This is pretty hard to show, so Cutty, just I can like turn around my laptop. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Thanks. Okay. So what happened now is actually a you can probably see. Uh, you just roll. No, no I, I'm gonna like <laughs> turn this. Can you actually see this? I am in the previous area still, <laughs> whereas <laughs> on uh, Arriva screen we are both still. <laughs> Yeah, so on the next start area. rolling. Will yeah. uh, it allows us to skip a cutscene, basically? Yeah, like right now, I'm rolling against the corner on my end. I can just stay here. Let's hope for the best. Cutty doesn't have to care about that uh, thing, so it's nice. <laughs> and I jump so things break. Oh. The, ca the camera tries to go back to where I am, but I'm in a different area that is not supposed to be loaded, yeah. so everything gets a bit confused. The individual level route uses the, uh, the desync, and it's quite funky. Yeah, it's really hard to pull off. And at the moment, I have a brown screen, and yeah, <laughs> like that. That's what happens. But yeah, I yeah. guess that's Guardian of Light. A yeah, fail, that's Guardian game. of Light. If anyone wants to pick up a good co-op game to speedrun, here's a good choice. Or to just play. It's or really to fun. just play. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I know. But then I explain how to do the nation incentive. 